welcome to my YouTube channel, Rated Corina. Okay, medyo matagal-tagal na hindi ako gumagawa ng personal na vlog. And this is going to be one of the first kasi alam nyo naman, sobra tayong naging busy ngayong Pasko, lalong kapag babae ka, para kang octopus. Walo dapat ang kamay mo kasi sabay-sabay na ang pinagawa mo. And one of the things na kinabisihan natin lahat is, tiyaran, hindi lang pagkain, hindi lang mga regalo, ang Christmas tree. Right? Okay, so, huli man at magaling, para sa susunod na Pasko, meron na kayong plano. Okay, I will show you kung paano ko ginawa ang aking mga Christmas tree. Okay ba yun? For ideas for next year. Why not? Para malaman nyo kung paano ko dinecorate hindi lang isa, not just one, not just two, but three Christmas trees na iba-ibang mga theme. Okay? Ipapakita ko sa inyo kung paano ko pinili ang decorations, paano ko pinataba, paano ko pinabango, paano ko pinasigla, kaya lahat ang pumupunta sa aking mga bahay-bahay. Nagagandahan silang lahat. Sorry, ah, nagaangat ako ng bangko ko. Pero yan talaga ang aking expertise on Christmas tree. And I'm going to show you my tricks this past December 2022 so that you are prepared for Christmas, December 2023. So these are the ideas. Like and subscribe. Pero no muna kayo and get the ideas from this vlog. Handa na ba kayo? For our home in Cubao, this is our, hindi pa tapos, pero this is our tree. Pilar, we're going to show them our tree, right? Yes. Okay, wow. Look at the outfit with the... Unicorn. Unicorn and the shoes. The Cinderella shoes. Wow. With heels. Wow. The headband. And the pepe. Oh, uh kulit -huh. kulit ni pepe, no? Kulit kulit ni pepe. Oh, you smile, you smile, you smile. Quack, quack, quack. Ayan. Okay, I'm gonna show you and tour you. We are going to tour you around our Christmas tree. Oh, kita mo si Pepe Pilar. Si Pepe ang kulit. This is our Christmas card for the year. Holiday 22, that's Pepe and Pilar. And at the back, ayan. Uh, nagpapatubo kasi yung mother-in-law ko ng maraming poinsetya. So this is in Baguio. And that's why we have a lot of poinsettias in the house. Don't break that, please. Okay. So, these are the elements of our tree this year. We have uh, fake yung tree, fake yung tree, pero naglalagay ako ng tunay na cypress leaves na binibili ko sa Damwa. And, kasi ito, mabango. So, lahat ng trees na ginagawa ko, like in that other house in Makati, the house here, and the big house of their lola, akong naggumawa. So, nilalagyan ko parati ng fresh cypress leaves dahil ito, from Dangwa, real leaves, kahit matuyo, lalong bumabango. If you're happy and you know it, clap your balls. Ayan, okay. So these balls, I make it myself. I made it myself. Bumili ako ng tela. This is styropor. And I put a ribbon. And there are many kinds. May polka dot ribbon on stripes. So it makes it look more updated and new. Ayan, tsaka may mga malalaki. Yun, yung pinakamalalaki yung pinaglalaroan na nila. Huwag niyong sirain because mama made that. A cinnamon stick that you can buy in Dangwa. Tunay din siya. I just put a ribbon. So there are organic things in the tree. Yon. Yung mga ano, yung mga tunay like this one. Ito naman, in, in, this is imported. Nabili ko sa isang store. Malaking-malaking pine cone. 
So I like the, you know, the look of the pine cone against the glass, against, ayan, mga pine cone na ganyan. Nagmumukhang tunay ang tree. I buy my own ribbons and I make them. So gusto ko malaki yung mga ribbon and it's all over the tree. Okay, so this is something else that uh, might interest you. Yung pamangkin ko magaling gumawa ng origami. So itong mga origami Christmas balls na ito is, wow! Look at that! So nice! It's made of uh, paper, pero this will last you a lifetime. Each origami ball, ginagawa niya for 3 hours. Imagine? So I have many like that. Iba-ibang klase. So yeah. Pero for this tree, ito ang design na pinili namin. Okay. Yeah. So, it has, you know, something that is handmade. Hindi yung binili lang ng binili. Ito, handmade ko yan. O. Oh. Tapos, iba-iba yung size ng mga Christmas ball. So, this is fully sequined. Tapos, meron din, ayan, yung malalaki. May kintab. O, ito parang organic din ito na parang antique. So, it's about a mixture of textures. I like buying these things. Hindi siya tunay na glass. Ano siya? Um, ano tawag dito? Bakit siya nag, ayan, nagpipitik-pitik ko? <laughs> so, there, parang it's, uh, it gathers the light and it projects it. Kaya meron ako mga glass balls na walang color. Because parang nakakaganda din siya na ibang texture naman. And it magnifies the light. Talking about light, this year, pinalitan ko ang, yun ang bago ngayon this year. Pinalitan ko ang light. Gusto ko ngayon malalaki na yung light. Ganon. Hindi yung maliliit na ang hirap na, ang hirap punuin ng tree. Ito, uh, parang hindi ganun karami, pero well lit. At kitang-kita mo yung ilaw. So, I love the lights like this. I like it that it's bigger. Hanggang likod. Siyempre, ayoko na ng dadaya. Hanggang likod. Meron. And that's Bishop, my, my lolo. My lolo. Na, very healthy pa rin. Mm -hmm. And then, I put balls under. Para puno. Di ba? Parang may laman pa rin siya sa ilalim. Kahit wala pa yung mga gifts. It's already there. Ayan, mga tunay na cypress. And because of the kids, I now have, syempre, Santa Claus is climbing. At meron ng nanalo. Ayun siya. May nanalo na na Santa Claus. And of course, the traditional star sa pinakaibabaw. Dogs. Because we love dogs. Tcharan! Ayun yung tropa. So that's our tree this year. At hindi pa tapos. I have ito, pictures that I put on the tree. That's Mar and Paolo. And... Masa na yung iba? Okay, I now have to look for all of these photos because sinasabit ko ito. O, yan ang isasabit ko ngayon. Hold on! Man in Lola's place. So this was also my design. Before, it only used to be like gold balls. Ayan. Dapat parati pa rin mayroong organic material like itong nabibili ito sa Divisoria, sa, sa I think sa Dangwa, meron ito. Totoo ito eh, yung pine cone. Pero merong malalaki imported ito. Mas maliliit. Local siya. And hindi mawawala yung fresh. Hmm, bango. Hmm. Bango, bango, bango. Habang tumatagal, medyo tumitigas siya. Pero lalong bumabango, lalo pag mainit. Red and gold is the theme. Maganda ang kwento nitong mga ball na ito. Because this belong pa to the great-grandmother of Pepe and Pilar. Si... Lola Wawa. Ayan. Sa kanya pa yan. So, I made sure to put it in the tree kasi nasa baul lang. Ito pa sa kanya rin ito. Siyempre, 
kailangan may storya ang tree, right? Kailangan may storya. So, with the old, na napakatagal na nito sa pamilya, imagine, babasagin pa yan, ha? Kailangan talaga inaalagaan, pinupunasan. O, oh, ito pa. Yan, mga luma. And then, nahaluan mo ng mga bago. O, ito, mga bago na. Plastic lang yan, pero ang ganda, di ba? Lalo pag nalagyan ng ilaw. It's always nice to play with textures and I love these things kasi kita mo, parang yung ilaw sumisilip-silip tapos nagkakaroon siya ng nagkakaroon siya ng effect. I love this. Mga plastic lang ito. Medyo may kamahalan konti pero kung aalagaan for life. O, oh, yun. I put these things because mukhang tunay. Nagmumukhang talagang may bunga yung tree. And of course, you know that I love making ribbons. Pinaghalo ko itong white and gold ribbon with a red. And made it into a bow. So, when you look at the tree, there's a lot of texture. See? Pero ito ngayon ang bago. O, may ganito pa ako. Ayan. So, ito ngayon ang bago. Last year, with Pepe and Pilar, meron akong, tadaan, didagdagan ko na ng Minnie Mouse. Because we have babies in the house. And with Minnie Mouse, of course, there will always be a Mickey Mouse. The Mickey Mouse, the Santa Mickey Mouse. Last year, hirap na hirap ako humanap ng teddy bear. So, ito ang nabili ko. Mickey and Minnie, parang Pepe and Pilar. Because they're really into Mickey and Minnie before. Ngayon, ano na sila? Mario at saka mga princess. See? What happened to your face? Tadang! Full of sticker. <laughs> Can I see your hands? What's that? Okay, what? anong gusto mong patunayan, boy? I don't like. You don't like? <laughs> So, because we have new babies, Audrey and Leon, we have finally napan nakita ko na the perfect Santa teddy bear. I found it in Blue Magic. I found it in Blue Magic. See? So, it is now a kiddie tree. Yay! Oh, up to the top. And of course, you have to have Pare pareho ang mga style, but iba iba ang elements. So again, the secret is texture, may alive, ayan mga organic alive, may luma, may bago, iba ibang texture. What happened to you? Uh -huh. Pepe, but Pepe has so much in his face. What about you? No. No, you don't like? I, I have so much. You have so much. I know. You look like a robot. You look like a robot. And then they press. Ching! Oh. Oh. Ching! Oh. What will happen if I press this? Ching! Oh, see? You're a robot. <laughs> and you are... Have a nice dress with design. Do you like the tree? Wait, do you like the tree? Yes. Yes. Next year we'll put princess. Yes. Next year we'll put princess na, huh? And Superman. And Superman? And then the, and then the beautiful lights. And then they put the lights. When it's Christmas, they put, they put the light na later when it's Christmas na. <laughs> Ang gulo ng hair mo, girl. Para ka naglabada, ha? Which one is your favorite? My favorite is this one with this one. Oh, the teddy bear. Well, my favorite is this one with this one is with the baby. With the cherry? It's like a cherry, right? Berries. That's it. The last is the brown one. You know, this one is so old. This is from the mama of Kia. See? Very old. And then you have the Mickey and the Minnie. Mickey Mouse. Mickey and the Minnie. Come on, Christmas is all about the kids. Oh, it's Mickey. On the day itself, look, so many because it's a big family. And now we go to the And another Malacan bear. 
super daming gifts. Still Christmas here in my other home, and Bud is there waiting for me. Hi, Buddy! Happy New Year! Happy New Year, Bud! Ayan, itong entrance ko. Simple lang, kasi yung ibang wahay, marami, no? Kaya lang, parang ang gusto ko simple lang. Maybe next year I'm gonna put more lights in the trees, but ito lang. To me, that's all I need. Yung entrance, maraming ilaw. I have to have a wreath. Maganda tong ilaw na ganito. Medyo malaki. May konting ribbon na ako rin ang gumawa. Pine cone. And a wreath na nilagyan ko rin ng real pine leaves from Dangwa. O, yan pa lang eh. Yan pa lang, di ba? Ang saya na. O, now let's go inside. Okay, so now we're in another home. This is my... Uh, quarantine home whenever I'm working so it has to be fixed kasi madalas din ako dito okay so kung gusto ko mag-quarantine before going home to uh, family and the kids I have to stay here so tadaan there's the tree and yes Christmas is over but hindi ko pa rin binat tinatanggal ang Christmas tree ko because meron pa akong ibang bisitang darating na hindi ko masya sa schedule. So, it's still Christmas in my house and there are many gifts unopened dahil sobrang busy. Naku, thank you so much sa lahat ng nagbigay ng mga regalo. Marami pong salamat pa sa lahat ng food. Siyempre, kinain na. Okay? Alright. So, let's talk about my tree here in my quarantine place. As you can see, I love orange and in this house, Orange is, ayan, orange, ayan, orange. Ang mga, ano natin, ang mga accent there. Orange, orange. Okay? So, because of that, I thought orange should also be terno siya dapat sa bahay. Yun, ganun ako mag-decorate. Parang sa kubaw, hindi ba? It's red and green. And, um, Doon sa bahay ng Lola, it's red and gold because ganun din ang furniture. So here, it's different. It's brown, orange, taupe, ayan, parang gray, and teal blue. Ito, itong ganitong klaseng pagka-blue. Ayan. Pagka-blue na ganun. Ayan, ito, ito. Ayan. So medyo mas sophisticated itong tree na ito. I think you should decide kasi kung ano ang magiging color combination mo. And then, yun ang bibilin mo, di ba? Accent is um, silver. And everything else you buy, pero pa akong black, everything else you buy should be complementary. Kailangan yung terno siya para magandang tingnan. Okay? So, just like my other trees, just like my other trees, Gawa ko rin ito. Yan, bibili ako ng tela. Pinakita ko na ito sa inyo last year for all those who are just now tuning in to my YouTube channel. This is how I do my trees and this is my quarantine tree. Quarantine tree because it's in my quarantine house. Bibili ako ng styropor and then bibili ako ng magandang tela. Oh, hindi ba ang ganda? Parang puchi design. So all the colors I want are there. Tapos lalagyan ko ng ribbon. Bibili ako ng ribbon na terno. Matyaga ako sa ganyan. In fact, ito, ginawa kong parang ubas, mali, mas malilit na styropor, na bibili lang yan sa National Bookstore, mga craft store, and then pinagsama-sama ko sila, parang ubas. Okay? So, yan ang aking, yan ang aking vocational arts. Okay? Ito, may mas malalaki, iba-iba ang size. There, see? And it should be spread all over the tree. Evenly. Kailangan pare-pareho ang mga distansya sa isa't isa. Okay? Now, ganun din ang ginawa ko sa brown. Yung mga, oh, mura lang ito. So, bibili ako ng brown, ginawa kong parang uba. So, it becomes more special. Hindi yung pa isa isa lang siya. Gawin yung parang ubas. And then, parang lumalaki siya. Para siyang nagiging mas, parang, parang Christmas tree ng mayaman. <laughs> 
parang ganon di ba? Okay. So that's a style. Okay, of course, what else? I have my ribbons. Ito mga ribbons na ito, binibili ko pa ito sa abroad. Kasi, hindi lahat ng ribbons na gusto ko, nakikita ko sa Pilipinas. Pag nag abroad ako, nagkataon, may trabaho, ganyan. I see ribbons that I like, I buy it. So, these ribbons I bought in Prague. Imagine. So, Europe ko pa ito binili. Hi, Trina! Happy New Year! Happy New Year, Trins! My rescue na Aspen. Yung ganda-ganda na niya. Okay. So, these are ribbons I bought from abroad. Ito rin. I bought this from abroad. Kumaganda na rin ang mga selection ng ribbons sa Pilipinas, pero hindi pa rin complete. Meantime, I've been using these ribbons for this tree for many years now. Oh, ito dito lang. National bookstore lang ito. Yung makapal. And then, doble-doble lang ang pag-ribbon mo para medyo malaki sa tree. Depende yan sa tree. Kasi kung malaki ang tree mo, like this one, Tapat medyo malalaki din ang iyong decoration. Alright. So, this are different shapes. May pahaba, may bilog. And, of course, may mga ganyan, kakaibang shape. And then, ito, ito pa rin yung origami na gawa ni Bobby, my nephew. Meron sa lahat ng tree ko niya, di ba? Yung bawat isa, three hours ginawa. So, it becomes a conversation piece. Bumili ako ng beads sa Carolinas. Yung mga nagbebenta ng beads, tsaka tela. And I made this with the colors that I like. And that became part of the tree. Kasi nakakatuwa yung sa malayo, hindi mo kita, pero pag lumapit ka, tsaka nakikita mo may detalye, may ibon pala doon, na steel colored, and may ibon pala doon, na mukhang feathers and all. Right? And of course, meron pa rin ako yung tunay na dahon galing dangwa. In order ko ito para mabango. Sinisiksik kong ganyan para kumapal yung tree at mukha siyang tunay. Pero fake lang yung nasa loob. Oh. Okay, so I have organic stuff like this. It's a real plant but it's preserved. I still have my pine which I love, which is so Christmas to me. And pine cone na ganito. Bumibili ako ng mga giant na ganyan. And there! Actually, yun lang naman. Tapos syempre, gusto ko meron siyang nasa pinaka-inabaw, yung star. And this time, I used bigger lights. Ito ang pinalitan ko. Kasi feeling ko mas special pag mas malaki ang mga lights na hindi yung maliliit na kalat-kalat. So, there. And hindi ako masyadong super borloloy sa house. Wala na sa magdanan. Wala na sa ibang mga room. Okay. Next year, baka magpaparol ako sa garden. But the sala is clean because all you need really is a beautiful Christmas tree, right? Orange, teal, taupe, brown, and silver for this home of mine. I'm very happy that you stayed to watch all the three trees na ginawa ko. Nakakuha ba kayo ng mga tips? Basta panoorin nyo na lang ng panoorin yung vlog para masulat ninyo yung mga tips na binigay ko sa inyo. Diba? Yung pagpumbrang dawa, paggawa ng Christmas balls, yung iba-ibang mga kulay na pagsasamasamahin. And guess what? Ngayon pa lang ako magbababa ng mga Christmas tree ko. Gusto ko nang paabuti ng February. Eh. <laughs> Hindi ba? Pero kasi ganda-ganda niya. But... Remember, when you take down your trees, kailangan punasan ninyo lahat. Lagyan nyo ng styropor yung mga babasagin. And kailangan maganda ang pag-storage ng lahat ng inyong mga gagamitin for next year. So that, walang mawala. And organize lahat. Put labels, etc. So now, dahil tapos ang Pasko, magbubukas na ako ng mga regalo na hindi pa nabubuksan. So, watch out for my vlog of my unboxing ng lahat ng mga regalo ko. Uy, exciting! Ano mga mga natanggap ko? That's next on my YouTube channel. So, like and subscribe. All my shows are in this channel. Uh, TikToks, Rated Corina, and Corina Interviews. And of course, all my personal vlogs. Si Pepe and Pilar, dito nyo rin mapapanood. And every all the life hacks for stuff. Dito na lang kayo sa aking YouTube channel na Rated Corina. All right. So thank you very much for watching. 
and belated Merry Christmas, advanced Happy Valentine's, and advanced Merry Christmas for 2023. Mwah.